Hi there. In this video, we're going to talk about WebEx Teams. And when you're in a call, not being able to access either the microphone, the camera, or being able to share your screen with others. I'm going to jump into my test space and get right into a phone call. Right away, when I do that, it tells me that I do not have WebEx Teams access. And it will not even let me proceed until I make sure that my microphone is working. This will work for both your camera and your microphone, as well as sharing your screen. But we're going to start with just the camera and microphone. I'm going to come into System Preferences on my Mac. I'm going to switch to Security and Privacy. In order to protect your Apple set security and privacy settings that you need to come in here and change in order to use your camera and your microphone. When I scroll down, I'm selected on the Privacy tab, when I scroll down to Camera, I see that WebEx Teams is not checked. I'm going to click Later for this one. I'm also going to check it under Microphone and make sure that WebEx Teams is checked. What it's telling me to do here is to quit WebEx Teams or to sign out of WebEx Teams and start it up again. For the purposes of this demonstration, I'm not going to do that. But for you, you'll want to sign out or quit WebEx Teams. In order to close WebEx Teams, I come down to the WebEx Teams icon, click and hold and select Quit, or I go to WebEx Teams at the top and select Quit WebEx Teams. That's all we need to do to have these settings adjust the next time we start up the WebEx Teams app. Great. Now I should be able to start my call. I'm going to select your link test space, start the call, and now you can see that I'm not going to have issues starting the call. But I will still have issues sharing my screen. So here where I select the screen share icon and select screen, if yours does not show anything or just shows a blank background, you'll need to come into the System Preferences, Security and Privacy, the same area we were just in, and then we'll scroll down to Screen Recording. Make sure that WebEx Teams is selected, and again, you can use this Quit Now feature to quit the WebEx Teams app. The next time WebEx Teams starts up, you should be able to share your screen. Let's hop back into the space, start the call, and now all three of my settings are turned on so that I can properly run my meeting, connect with my video, use my microphone, and share my screen appropriately. And that's how you change your microphone, camera, and share screen settings on your Mac so that you can use them in WebEx Teams calls.